Assalamualaikum. Hi guys, my name is Ismail from Cheap Mail Flea. So today I am going to show you my shoe collection. I haven't actually stored my shoes in the shoe closet because I kind of want to show you the shoes that I have before I put them in. So I hope you enjoy this shoe collection that I want to share with you. So without wasting any more time, let's go. So before I share with you the shoe collection, let me just share with you the state of the house. I received a feedback from my friends is that the, the previous in the previous video, my camera work is very shaky. So because I was holding like a quite a heavy camera and I didn't realize that it would cost you cost them um, some mild uh, nauseousness when watching my videos. I'm trying to record this with a very steady hand. Let me just share with you. This is the niche that I actually decorated. Um, What's the point when I have all this mess on the kitchen counter? Um, well, this is the reality uh, shoes on the counter. I probably should like clean up. I think those pictures in those magazines is not like the real way people live. This is what's supposed to be the dining table, but it has turned into like a makeshift office. Anyway, these are the shoes that I have to unpack and share with you before I actually store them in the shoe closet. I've been sleeping in the living room because I find it like this the best spot and it has this um, like natural light from the window. So this is the sofa that I've decorated a bit with like kind of like a Moroccan feel. <laughs> Probably not. <laughs> Okay, so this is the damage so far. I realized that um, there's actually not so many shoes, right? <laughs> so anyway, so these are my sneakers. I used to be so obsessed with slip-ons and I still love them. These are my Toms. These are from Pedro. I love sandals right now. These are my favorite. This is from Zara. Can you believe that Miu Miu used to have for menswear and I got this and obviously I don't know how to take care of them. <laughs> I've never worn them before but they are not in really a pristine uh, condition right now uh, and I still like them so I'm gonna keep them. So I actually wanted to do uh, like an un unboxing video because I'm doing my recording my shoe collection right now so I have a hack. So for me to actually show that I actually haven't unboxed this box is to actually <laughs> open on the reverse side. See? That's what I did. This is the shoe that I bought. Um, this is a an Adidas Supercard which everybody has but I like this because it's a bit different from from what everybody else is wearing. Um, I like that it's in black and white and it's in canvas and then it has this um, what do you call this? Uh, like a logo I think so this is how you fake an unboxing okay so these are like my top five favorite shoes right now I mean like based on what I own right now um, my Air Force which I only wore once um, unfortunately they are not like the most comfortable thing to wear when you go to work so that's the reality so these are what everybody has this Converse play white sneaker uh, it goes well with a lot of things, so that's the upside. Um, this, my new super cord, which I haven't had the opportunity to wear because brother wanted to save it for his unboxing. Um, plus, it's white, so that sucks. Um, I have to like really take good care of them. And the last person on earth to actually take good care of their shoes is me. Um, my fake Gucci sandals, because brother's on a budget, plus brother's not really into big brands. Uh, talking about not into big brands, this is Helmut Lang. When Helmut Lang was designing for Helmut Lang, Helmut Lang, Helmut Lang, I think it's Helmut Lang. Um, yeah, it is what it is. Um, yeah, so yeah, so these are like my top five favorite shoes right now.
damage that I've done to the house. Yay yeah, me. Okay, so um, beside this is where the shoe cabinet is, is where I'm gonna store all the shoes here. So when we were designing the house, um, before the owner actually had a shoe cabinet installed likewise, but it was in a different color. And I actually like uh, the fact that the shoe cabinet is here and then it created like this entryway, like a sudden entryway. So like when you walk in, and then you know there is like this small little uh, lane here and then obviously it's not supposed to look like this that is so messy one two three four five six so um so one shelf you can actually put three so at least there's like 18 9 18 27 30 you can put in 36 pairs of shoes uh, my mom's slipper is here. So yes, so right now I'm just gonna fill up this uh, shoe cabinet with all my shoes Okay guys, so this is what I've done to my shoes. I've actually categorized them so that uh, it's neater and like I know which type of shoe is where so that you know it's more organized. So what I've done is I decided to uh, actually put one shoe facing front and then the other side facing the back because like for example at the top here if i was to put the shoe both shoe uh, on the same side then i probably forgot like hey, what shoe is this you know like for example like that like hey, what shoe is that i mean like yeah i can just simply take it out and see what it is but in this case i don't have to, uh, i don't actually have to take it out i can just you know align oh this is like my brooks my black brooks my french connection broke and that is my club broke so and also because shoes are normally wider at this part so if all the shoes are facing one direction you know then it might not fit exactly so i and i also like the fact that i can see that the back of the shoe to see what design it is so at the top is the brooks and then followed by those leather lace ups so these are my sneakers and the missing hole for another pair of sneakers and then i decided that because these are the shoes that i constantly reach out for so they have to be at a position where it's easy for me to access so in this case i always wear sneakers to work and then like like if on my off days i like to wear my sandals so it's easier it's more reachable and i don't have to like you know like wonder what's upstairs or even you know have to bend down to see um the shoes below so these are the sandals that i always reach out for and then below are all my moccasins moccasins and like all those slip-ons that i don't reach for anymore at the moment because i'm like more into sneakers now so this is how i organize my shoe collection unfortunately these are the shoes that did not make um the shoe cabinet <laughs> simply because i'm like um i'm not into them anymore one of the worst purchases i think those calvin klein cowboy inspired boots that were very popular look at, look at the excess amount of pointed like okay guys thank you so much for watching this video i hope you really enjoy uh, my shoe collection and also tips on how i organize my shoes uh, so i hope that i can see you in the next video bye oh, now i have to clean all this mess